Well, if you stepped outside today, you definitely felt the heat. It's the hottest day of the summer so far. We followed the crowds in Worcester to find out the popular spots to cool off. Our Brittany Schaefer was by the water today and has more from people who are trying to beat the heat. Brittany? Patricia, hundreds of Worcester residents were at spray parks in Worcester City beaches. Even now at 6 o'clock, my phone is reading it's 87 degrees out. Beating the heat, I mean, it doesn't get any better than that. Wednesday is the hottest day of summer so far in Worcester. A common escape from the heat was to be by the water. It's fun and, and, it was, and I was hot and my mom said I could come in to cool off. It's going to be 90 plus, so I figured we'd come with my daughter and go swimming and spend the day at the lake, get out of the hot, sweltering heat. We like, like getting dumped by water buckets here. Two hot spots in the city today were Shore Park Beach and the Spray Parks. Worcester residents say the water temperatures were refreshing. Oh man, I felt so good when I went in the water. It was so hot. As soon as I went in, my body just felt so good. I didn't, I didn't want to leave the water. Water is actually pretty good. It's not cold. It's not hot. And I'm going in there because I'm going to try to teach them how to swim without a life vest. The city's two spray parks, pool, and four beaches open July 1st. I think it's great because it kind of brings the community together. You can meet new people and also just, you know, it's something that everyone can come out and enjoy. A lot of Worcester residents come here, so they run into friends from school, from camps, so it's just easier for them to play. The hot, humid weather is forecasted to be around for a few days. It has some thinking about how to keep cool after leaving the water. AC. Just stay cool and then once we leave here, go to the air conditioning. At our house, we have air conditioners and fans. Now tomorrow's temperature is expected to hit 90 again. To stay safe during this heat wave, Red Cross says to stay hydrated, to take breaks from being outside, and to check on children and the elderly. Patricia, back to you. Thanks. For